Hello everyone, myself Bharadwaj. In this video, I will discuss about edge triggered wiping relay block. First, open your PLC software. On the left side, scroll down and under timer category, you can find this edge triggered wiping relay and select here. Add the comment. It is edge triggered wiping relay. And there are two inputs and one output. The first input is trigger and the second input is reset. These are digital inputs and output. So take digital inputs and one digital output connect inputs and outputs i will use i3 and i4 you can use any input no issue i3 is my input i4 is my reset Q1 is my output. Now open the PLC hardware and download the program. If you don't have the PLC hardware with you, no problem. Just do the simulation and test your program. If you found the course interesting, share our videos with your friends and your network. Subscribe to our channel for more updates. I am going to the online. So, previously we discussed about wiping relay, which is nothing but pulse output block. And this one is edge triggered wiping relay. What this block do is, it generates output pulses based on the input and your settings block settings open the block if you see there are three parameters the first one is number of pulse cycles how many pulses you want it as output one pulse two pulses three pulses like that you can select in between one and nine I will select 2. Okay. Now, when the pulse is generated, how much time you want the pulse to be in on state? Okay. This is my TH, pulse width. Select minutes and let's say I want 4 seconds. My pulse will be on for 4 seconds. And I want a uh, minimum 8 seconds gap between two pulses. So what is the setting now? I want two pulses and each pulse will be on for 4 seconds and the interval between the time interval between each pulse is 8 seconds. So, 4 seconds output will be on, 8 seconds will be off, like that 2 times. 
press ok now i will turn on the input i3 observe the timer is started first the 8 seconds is running output is off next the 4 seconds timer is running output is on one pulse is completed again it is repeating same cycle because i selected two pulses this is the second pulse after 4 seconds output is off okay we will repeat this again go to properties i want the output to turn on for 5 seconds or i will reduce it 3 uh, okay i will go with 5 seconds and off is 8 seconds i will leave it like that and i want 5 pulses this time i need 5 pulses on time is for 5 seconds each pulse in between time gap is 8 seconds that means 5 seconds on 8 seconds off again 5 seconds on 8 seconds off this will start with off second off cycle okay remember this is edge triggered okay the input must change its state from low to high then only this block will be active okay i will show you another case okay after this i will show you another case edge triggered now the timer is running this is of uh, 8 seconds is completed again 4 seconds output on next 8 seconds off again 4 seconds on like that as i selected 5 pulses 5 times the output will be on and off with the required pulse width and time gap okay let's suppose i will press the reset what happens output is off timer is zero in the meantime i turned on the input but nothing happened because the reset is having the high priority over the input okay now i will turn off the reset see the timer is not started even though the input is on why because this block input is operated when the input change its states from 0 to 1 it needs rising edge input only in on state is not considered when the input is required in edge rising edge rising edge means input has to rise from 0 to 1 the value has to increase then only it will start the input is off now again on off now the input is rising edge that is where timer is started the cycle will repeat clear you can reduce the timing say i want 2 seconds on 2 seconds off and i want 9 pulses So this is how edge triggered wiping relay block works. If you remember, we already discussed about wiping relay function block. Share with us what are the main differences between the wiping relay block and edge triggered wiping relay block with us through the comment section. And if you have any experience with the programming or in industries, share with us how we can use these blocks in process control industries or in control philosophies. Okay. Thank you. I will meet you in the next session.